Welcome to Nova Videos. In this video you're going to learn about the usage of the build signal command and the calculation signal command. This demo creates a linear plot, square root of the scan rate versus the peak height, to show the reversibility of the electron transfer. First what we have to do is to open demo 05 from the demo database, drag twice the build signal command in the data, in the first build signal command we're going to define the scan rate. In the second build signal command we'll define the peak height. Then we drag the calculate signal command to the end to calculate the square root over the scan rate. Then we have to define a plot. Select on the x-axis the square root of the scan rate and on the y-axis the peak height. Result, we have created a plot to show the linear relation between the increase of the scan rate versus the peak height, to show the reversibility of the electron transfer. Welcome to Nova Software. First, we have to open demo data file 05. We go to library. In the library, we select the demo database. And in the demo database, we will find demo 05. In the demo 05, we will find a linear sweep voltammetry, which is repeated with different scan rates. In the LSV, there's automatically programmed the peak search. What we have to do is we have to extract information from the peak search and the scan rate. Well, first we have to find the build signal command, and we drag them twice behind the procedure because one is for the scan rate and the other one is for the peak height. First we're going to extract the scan rate. This is done uh, with the command type of the LSV because the scan rate is available in the linear sweep voltammetry staircase command and in this, if we select this, we will find the scan rate. We enable the scan rate And when I go back, I can look at my data grid to show the data. So I've extracted the scan rate. The second thing we have to do, we have to find the peak search, the automatic peak search. So we have to, for each scan rate, we've extracted the peak height. In the second build signal, again, the command type we're looking for is the analysis type. So we're looking for the command type Peak search. Peak search is available. And when you select this, you will see the peak height in here. We enable the peak height. And then we can look at the data grid again. And we have scan rate and peak height. So we already have the data available. The next thing we have to do is calculate the square root over the scan rate. So we have to drag the calculator behind this and this calculate signal command can calculate the square root over the scan rate. How do we do this? Well, we give it the signal name, square root scan rate and an expression. Expression can be square root over the scan rate, SR. The moment we've enabled SR, we can link it to a parameter. And this parameter is by scan rate. After we've done this, we can go back. And now we've extracted all the information which is needed. So I need peak, peak height, square root over the scan rate. And now we can plot these variables by adding more. When we press more, You can say plot, you can make a custom plot, and add a new plot, for example, square root over the scan rate versus peak height. In the x-axis, I can say square root over the scan rate, and in the y-axis, oh, in the y-axis, I can say peak height. 
and give it a plot number 2, for example. I can edit, give it a little bigger plots, and here are my points. And now I've made the linear relation between the square root of the scan rate versus the peak height. Thank you for watching Nova videos.